Hey, all listeners, welcome back to the Everman's Journey on Dirt Rally 2.0. We're going to take our favorite R2 Fiesta, three cylinders of turbocharged fury, out into Wales, which has a clear day for once. A clear day in Wales, goddamn. But again, very technical track. It'll be fun. Uh, it's a car we're familiar with, and it's a difficult rally, so let's learn a little bit and uh, see how we do. Middle of a grass 30. Good we'll be pushing, because we know the car. Uh, we're still not at max performance on this thing yet, so. Still lacking a little bit of power compared to the competition. We'll get there. I love how the start is just angled off. It's like, no, no, these roads are just so badly cambered. Five, the opposite four, of New Zealand. Three, uh, two, one, go. 30, middle of a crest, 30. Six right of a crest, long Titans, three. Into two left long. This is, this is our front wheel drive, so this thing is really relatively accurate on the turns. Right. Let's keep trying to push it to full speed here. Long. Into three right of a crest long, Titans. Fifty. Four left of a crest, slow thirty. Man, these roads are such a crumbly camera. Fifty. Turn unseen, two right long, Titans Let's bad go. camber. Titans bad camera. Into six left, Dude, that's pretty serious. Into slow. Five right Titans, pretty good. Into turn, hairpin left. Hairpin Open coming us. up. Into four left of a crest. Cool, we're revving the crap out of this poor engine. Bro, bro, you realize there's a hairpin, right? right? Into For your first gear, yep. Yeah. Ooh, that weight transfer! You want to meet those trees for weight transfer purposes, let me tell you what. Ah, so every time we drive this rally, you're riding a fucking bull of some sort. Absolutely insane levels of. Oh shit! We're okay! Ha! Into six left of a crest. Hey. Focus more. I can't even talk anything. Is so many turns? So many bad campers, so much compensation you need to make. Into four right long. Drives too low. Keep left of a thirty. Three right tightens. Into four left. Opens of a crest. Thirty. Six right through gate and jump. We're trying to push the long. pace here because we don't want to get too far behind. This is familiar right. car, so let's see what it can do. But there, we were eight seconds back in the first sector and we're ten seconds back in the second sector, which is not great. I think we'd be pushing a little harder here. But again, there was a couple like near misses we had that I had to compensate for, which slowed us down for sure. Opens and tightens. Again, the lack of familiarity with these courses is not helping because like, usually we learn to recognize bits and pieces more and Wales just doesn't seem to come up in our dailies that often or my other plays in this game so not by choice even, just the uh, nature of the beast. That was a two. Seems a little slow. So I'm less familiar with these than I would like to be. Yeah, it's ten seconds again. God damn. We're just not on the pace in Wales. That's the familiarity, a little lack there around. Right. Three right long Titans. Into three left long Titans. Opens of a crest. I mean, the car does feel stable through this, so I'm pretty happy with it compared to how it was in the wet. But, um, man, we are not setting a good time here. Luckily, we haven't wiped and screwed it up, but there were a couple near misses at the beginning there that probably cost us a decent time, honestly. Into two right long Titans. Slow keep left of a 70 turn unseen heavy right. Okay, right's coming. Crest and two left long. It's a sharp I remember, yeah. That's what I did in the first. Come on. Push, 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 push. Eight seconds again on the last sector. Got back to our original time. Yeah, it's uh, you know, Wales is tough. Very technical, a lot of bad camber. A lot of difficult things and a lot of weird, uh, weird angles you're taking. But we did what we could. The whole dash where we could. And once the car gets a little more power, get a little more experience, we'll do better. But hey, we're in the top end, so that's not too bad. Usually we're higher up on the leaderboard for R2s, but uh, that's the beast here. And again, just getting those angles right, getting the car's weight right. There's a couple near misses there that really slowed us down. You know, saving four more seconds overall could have gotten us a much higher time. And you know, nature of the beast. But hey, we're learning, and at least it was clean. Ish. Alright, I'm in our, see you next time on the Everman's Journey. Till then.